really high and um, you know, I think he's understanding what we want to do you know I feel like his offense is maybe a little bit ahead of where we need him to be defensively but he's making progress on that end too um, you know so I think for just a you know a, a player in his first four or five games uh, you know he's, he's making good progress what are some of the specific things you'd like to see him do better defensively uh, you know, just I think his activity around the paint. You know, there's times when I think he's maybe you know whether it's his help or his rotation, he can be a little bit a little bit quicker to recognize it. Um, you know, sometimes when we're changing pick and roll coverages, just being you know really dialed into what we're doing pick and roll. Um, you know, away from the ball. You know, it's uh, there's some you know in our league there's fives that are shooting threes and it's not just fours. And you know, at times you may. Um, you know, get a little bit too disconnected, um, but it's all, to be honest with you, kind of normal stuff. And you know, there's veteran guys that are kind of, you know, we're harping on them about the same things. You have a development plan for him and also and all the young guys. But when he's producing the way he is, is there any like temptation to kind of throw him out there to an even bigger role than you're giving him now? Um, not really. You know, there's. I think you know he's earning minutes and you know um, playing him more and just giving him more exposure, but. You know, I'm happy with Dwayne too. I think those two guys are kind of manning that five spot. Um, they're both doing well, and um, you know the way we play, it's uh, you know a lot of you just kind of take what the game gives you, and, and his role offensively is a lot just dictated by reads and um, reactions. So um, he's in a good place, I think, right now. We want to just continue just you know step by step progress with him.